Today was our final port of call, Gibraltar, which feels like going home to both of us as we have many happy days here. So, on with our story. This is the view from our balcony here in Gibraltar. The infamous cloud over the rock and the city as it is at the moment. Lovely to be back. We took the shuttle into town and then started wending our way up through Main Street in Gibraltar. So here we are back in Gibraltar after an absence of about three years, which is a hell of a long time for us, isn't it, Lindsay? It is, yeah. It's like being home. It is just like being home. Nothing's really changed. The drains still smell. Well, I think it's the drains. There could be other reasons for it. Doesn't it, Lindsay? Neither Lindsay or I are that keen on shopping, but when it gets to Gibraltar, we find it quite interesting. If you're enjoying this video and would like to see more, please hit the like button and subscribe to the channel. Then hit the notification bell to sure you catch up with all future releases. Four pence cheaper than up the road. Four pence? Yeah. So here we are, coming home now to Gibraltar to our local pub and as usual we've come to the angry fryer but breaking this tradition I think I might actually have a cup of coffee which is strange for me so here we are in Gibraltar just having a quick stop at the government house um, next to the angry fryer guns here and uh, yeah nice to be back in Gibraltar again so Lindsay here we are in the Lord Nelson pub in Gibraltar just come in for a little drink a couple of pints nice old place this is our second local isn't it dear it is. so what have you thought about being back in Gibraltar it's just like being home it's really nice nothing much has changed a few of the shops have been updated a few new ones, um, but the prices seem very similar to the last time that we were here, which is good. So have you been shopping today? We have, we've actually been shopping. And um, what have you bought today? Uh, Hendrix and Sipsmith gin. And, and what did you pay for your gin? I can't remember. Uh, let me remind you, yeah. I believe that the Hendrix was 21.95. And the Sipsmith was 21.90. So here it is, our little beers have just arrived. Um, so yeah, so we, we had some good prices on the gin and then we're going to pick up some cigarettes later for our friend Gordon um, and see what sort of a deal we can get on them. We've been looking but haven't really sought out the best price yet. We made our way back to the ship, had a quick game of quoits where Lindsay gave me a thoroughly good thrashing again. And then prepared for sail away. And thanks to good old P&O, they'd given us a sail away drink which you saved up for our favourite port. After saying goodbye to Gibraltar, we went back to the cabin and watched a film on the interactive television. Tonight was going to be a special night for us as it was our first visit to the Limelight Club. None of the previous acts while we were on board really appealed to us, but on this occasion, it was Toya, and being the age group that we are, we thought we'd attend. And we weren't disappointed. On behalf of myself, Vivek, the entire team, and of course, not forgetting the star of the show this evening, I wish you all the most memorable evening here in the Limelight Club. To begin the evening we had our food and I must admit the starters were so good we forgot to film them. Anyway, here's our main courses which we did manage to film. 
I had the lamb cutlet and Lindsay had the sea bass. Everyone, this is the brilliant Chris Wong. Hooray! Don't encourage him too much, he's got such a big head. Last night we went to the Limelight Club. What did you think of it? It's our first experience of the Limelight Club. What did you think of it and uh, how enjoyable was it? It was very good actually. Um, the meal was so-so. It wasn't anything special, the meal, but it was very well presented and quite tasty. Um, there was, for us, there was an issue that we were facing the wrong way and sat with visibility that was somewhat impaired um, but if you swizzled the chair around and moved about a bit you could then see uh, the act that came on that was Toya um, and tiny as she is she really packs it away again oh she's she's very much as I remember her in the 80s and she's extremely personable um, told some really funny stories of her time in the 80s as, as a singer and how she started her career um, and yeah it ended up being a very pleasant evening